Good morning, you guys. So that weigh in, I'm very, very happy with it. I'm excited to see that the scale is moving in the right direction and that um, everything that I was doing this week was really good. Um, I still haven't been feeling well, so I have not been to the gym this week. I haven't been that active. So that just goes to show that that is all diet. So you can lose weight with just counting calories and, and paying attention to your diet. I do recommend obviously getting moving, which is something that we're going to be doing today. Um, but yeah, I'm very happy with it. I'm very excited. Excited to see the, the numbers finally go down again after what seems like a stall forever. Um, I'm about to eat breakfast, so I'm having some oatmeal. Of course, my V8 and my coffee this morning, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Decided to go for a little family walk with Scout, who stops at every everything. everything. Um, there is a, a pet store that's just down the street, so we're gonna walk there. Just get moving. It's such a pretty day outside. The pet store was a great success. We ended up getting Scout a, uh, a new harness and, uh, and leash, as well as like a little bowl that we can take with us when we go on walks with her so very very good and then we walked to this like lot it's just like an empty empty lot but check out the view nice little uh nice little view of downtown so we're gonna hang out here maybe throw the frisbee around just enjoy being outside being in the sunshine and uh, the good weather now we are in an area known as Deep Ellum. We're trying out this place called Amsterdam Falafel. Um, I got a bowl which has like the falafels on the bottom and then you get to put like different stuff in it, which has like fresh eggplant and zucchini sauce and pickles and then Kelly and I are sharing some fries. I'm excited about this because when we were in California, we found a falafel place that I can eat at and I've been searching for one since we got back. So I'm excited that we found one. I'm gonna eat this up and then we'll talk to you guys in a minute. Just finished up at the falafel place and it was so, so good. So basically you can get a bowl or a pita, I got a bowl, um, and then they put your falafels in it and then there's like a little salad bar type place where you can just put all your toppings. Very, very good. So if you're ever in Deep Ellum, I highly recommend it. And also one thing that I found really, really cool about this place is when you went to the restroom, it said usually female and mostly male and then they had a little sign talking about how they are transgender allies and that they are transgender friendly so you know use the bathroom that you feel the need to use and if you have a problem you can go down the street and use 7-eleven's restroom and i thought that was awesome the best it was the best because that has been a big big issue here in texas here especially here in texas right now um with the whole bathroom issue but yeah i thought it was really cool amsterdam falafel definitely go check them out and now for the real adventure of the day okay so i've been wanting a bike for quite a while it's just something that i want to do i want to be able to ride a bike around town and just on the trail so and i've never ridden a bike in like 15 years which is a very long time so we're gonna try it out on these so just like the little rent a bike things um so we're gonna try it out uh we're here at fair park we're gonna ride around the park see number one if i can actually ride a bike still <laughs> and number two what i think so yeah let's see what happens so that station did not work but i downloaded the app we're on the hunt for the other station in this area that says it's working and that they have bikes there so we'll see what happens yay <laughs> we have found the bikes so we're gonna see if this one works go for a ride no go on the bikes apparently you have to like have a membership not like a membership but you have to like log on online and all of this stuff to have an account and our city is awesome and doesn't maintain their website so we couldn't sign up for an account therefore no, no bikes. bikes so we're walking back to the car all in all it was a really good day now we're gonna go home and food prep for the week and enjoy the rest of our evening what better way to drown my sorrows of no bike than a snow cone 
So I ended up getting um, a banana coconut. So I'm gonna have this treat myself because I'm upset about the bikes. And it actually looks like the clouds are rolling in. So it's probably for the best. Just editing up the video, food is prepped for the, for the week. Um, what we're doing this week is pretty much the same as we did last week as far as lemon pepper chicken and then flank steak. And then for sides, we're having baked sweet potatoes, steamed broccoli, and we did cauliflower fried rice, <clears throat> excuse me, instead of just cauliflower rice and white rice. Um, one thing about the cauliflower rice, even the, the cauliflower fried rice, is it's a lot more volume for a lot less calories. So definitely I'm going with that this week. Overall for the week, I'm happy with everything. I feel like I'm back on track as far as counting my calories and all of that. And I'm happy with how the scale is reflecting that. Um, <clears throat> a couple of things that I had that I felt were a little bit challenging this week. Number one is just feeling that like little bit of hunger. Um, it's something that I haven't felt in a really long time because I haven't been counting my calories um, and two my sweet tooth I have the biggest sweet tooth and I am trying to curb it But that is one thing that I that I've had a big challenge with this week as far as like not eating sweets like every day um, So my goals for this next week are definitely going to be keep moving That's going to be super key for me is keep moving whether it be walking or finding a freaking bike to ride, cause that's still a goal, um, <laughs> or going to the gym or whatever, it may be a combination of all of that. Definitely want to keep moving. I think I'm gonna keep my calories the same. Maybe try to not, I don't know. I, I think I'm just gonna keep everything the same cause I feel like I'm progressing and I don't necessarily wanna change anything as of right now. But that is going to be it. Today was such a productive day, I felt, I don't know, it just felt good to like move and do stuff all day long. Um, as far as dinner for tonight, I'm not really that hungry, so I'm just gonna end the night with my breakfast shake that I normally have, and that's gonna be it for food. Thank you guys so much, and I'll check in with you next week.